have tried other courses too, but I think this is the most serious course you can have and there is very good teachers. Uh, you are divided in different levels, so you get the right level and I think it's very important uh, when learning salsa. It's always fun because all these teachers, they're very good. dancing a lot and I know a lot of different styles but I've never done that much partner dancing. And it was nice to get a stable dance partner to get to know how to dance and yeah that he can lead me. And they are funny and they know how to help us and to assist us and teach us something and then you don't feel like an idiot if there's something that you can't do or you don't know. Then they say okay we'll just take it one more time or ten more times if that's what it takes. And uh, they like to dance with you and uh, you are important to them so, and I think it's, they give you a good feeling. So it's really great to learn how to follow as well. They're good, they're good leaders. <laughs> I think it's nice to have your partner uh, with you and to take care of you. So I like that because it's, they're really good at, at what they do. So I think you choose some, some great people to help us. I tried other courses and, and it is not the same. This is absolutely the best. <laughs> Uh, well organized. You can talk to the Cubans too and uh, you dance to them, you can take them out in the night for parties if you want to. I like this hotel because it's nice to go into town and see what they got there and all the streets and the shops. Every day there is a program for what you are going to do. You can join it or you can leave it if you don't want. So you can have your own time if you want that. I think that's very good. I like it when we go back here in the car and everything is green and there's a lot of palm trees and it's another atmosphere so it's good to divide the two and then go to different places and see what's around and then we can have the classes at the same place we don't have to move away from that we just go down the stairs so I think that's, that's brilliant. <laughs> I love Cuba. It's my second country, I think. I think it's really exciting. It's a really great way to travel, to be active and uh, have something to do. I think it's a great way of showing people what Cuba also can be. To see the country, because it's a very, very beautiful country, and uh, to meet the people. Not only the touristic stuff, but also get into the culture of it. Every time I come home and people ask me, they don't know anything and they think it's all politics. I say, I'm not involved in that, I just go here for the culture. concerts and the dancing and that's a level that's so high that you just feel like whoa I'm witnessing something great here. We were at a place called Casa de la Musica and there was a live band playing. The biggest Havana one in Havana. Yeah, biggest one in Havana at the Primera. It was such a rush yeah. last yeah. night. Oh I I was 
feeling ecstatic. Because there's one hell of an atmosphere and everyone's like, yeah! <laughs> How they just they get ecstatic as well they're partying dancing you wouldn't see that at home no. ever no they can't stop themselves it's yeah like, it's like yeah, yeah, yeah. you have to use the music or I don't know but sometimes they, they got so high on the music <laughs> yeah. that you just had to stand back and just watch just watch what they're doing because it just went crazy yeah. it went crazy and and yeah it was just a feeling yeah. it was it was amazing really to um, improve your dance skills uh, it's absolutely the best way it's go to Cuba see how the Cubans are dancing and, and uh, you can take that home with you to be a better dancer I'm sure I'm gonna get back if you can <laughs> tolerate me <laughs> <laughs> yes we can <laughs>